Yo, what's up, soul family? So let me tell y'all something, man. Every single God is in God's star of all divine alien races in the angel number multiverses are, just like what I said, are gods and goddesses. Every single soulful individual that I have seen in person or in telepathic social media, every single one of those soulful beings of all divine alien races, I see God, I see goddesses. You know what I'm saying? So let me break this down and explain this. If a frog, a tiger, a jaguar, a cheetah, a lion, a bear, a fish, a squid, octopus, copper-skinned aliens like me, if we practice at something and get better at something, that's what a god is, right? That's what a goddess is, right? If a female of, of any divine alien race for example, let's say you take a copper-skinned female from the country Sierra Leone or Barbados or Trinidad. If she gets better at belly roll and twerking and all that stuff, any form of dancing, that shows that she's a goddess. You know what I'm saying? If a dude, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? If a human dude gets better at break dancing, footwork with dancing, getting better at baseball soccer anything right that is the definition of a male who is a god so you got males and females that can practice martial arts right let's go into this so ma can't say from kenichi to Midas, disciple sakaki shigure ikasame apachai Hayato Ferengi, you know, Miyu Ferengi's grandfather. All of those martial artists are martial arts. They're masters, right? And they train and get better and got stronger in the martial arts that they perform, which shows that they are gods and goddesses. Shigure is a goddess of weapons. Like, if you read the, the Kenichi manga and the anime, you see that she get better anytime she used projectile weapons in martial arts. Ma Kensei, who is the master of Chinese Kenpo. That dude is a legend. This dude is a god of Chinese Kenpo. Sakagi, the god of karate. Ikasame, the god of jujitsu. Apachai, the god of Muay Thai. So anything, if you train in martial arts, like these people that I just mentioned, these these goddesses and god stars of the Kenichi show that I mentioned, if you get better at something, that shows that you a god. So of course, gods are all around. Goddesses are all around the angel number multiverse because the angel number multiverse revolves and is focused and channeled through all the god stars and goddesses of the multiverse like me. Every video that I have made on YouTube, Facebook, you know what I'm saying? Any deep topic I talk about, I get better. That is the definition of a god. So god stars and goddesses, the definition of it is the individual, whether male or female, gets better at something that they do. If you can get better at a video game, if your muscle memory gets better at anything that you're trying when it comes to riding a bike or driving a, a vehicle, flying a rocket, a plane, you know what I'm saying? You're learning how to run, learning how to walk, learning how to crawl, learning how to swim. You're getting better learning how to fly with your kinetic DNA powers. Come on, man. That shows that you are a goddess and a god star because god stars and goddesses get better at everything that they try and strive to do. Matter of fact, not even try. Just get it up and do it. You know what I'm saying? We, we just going to leave the word try out. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, yo. And you know why I'm holding this necklace up, right? You know, this all-seeing mind, heart, and soul eye of divine god stars and goddesses of all divine alien life forms of the angel number multiverse from universe 1 to universe 55 and infinity and beyond that. 
and new universes being made by each cosmo beings. You know what I'm saying? Each single soulful individual, whether it's a god star of an alien race or a goddess of, of an alien race, can create a new dimension, a new planet within the new universe that they made. You know, I can create a new universe right now, just like any other soulful god stars and goddesses of all divine alien races, because that's the definition of what a god star and goddesses is. Chosen ones, a.k.a. otherworldly soulful beings, a.k.a. intelligent futuritarians, you know, <laughs> advanced, emotional and intelligent beings, regardless of their divine alien race are god stars and goddesses because they strive to do better getting better in anything that they train to manifest to bring that physical presence of what they strive to achieve into alchemy reality man come on son you don't even need a bible to talk about this shit dog you don't need a quran to talk about this shit dog this shit comes from intuition intelligence from the mind heart and soul my friend yes indeed yes indeed you know how we like it, BB. Mm -hmm. Goku transforming into Super Saiyan, right? Getting better, getting better at Super Saiyan One, Super Saiyan Two, Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Blue. Getting stronger within those transformations. He 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 going to, you know, the angels got Ultra Instinct. They train to get better, right? Because that's the that's what a God star and a goddess is. You know, <laughs> Grand Priest. You think he was just born? You know. <laughs> Come on, bro. You think he was just literally just born the way he was? He got better at what he do. Vegeta got better at what he do. Yami Yugi got better at what he do. Mega Man. Shit, I got the Yami Yugi shirt on, bro. Come on. Come on, sir. <laughs> Come on, son. I'm about to bring a lot of soulful elevation to the god stars and the goddesses of the angel number multiverse, letting you realize and comprehend and install inside your memory bank with inside your all seeing mind, heart, and soul DNA that you, my god stars and goddesses of all divine alien races, from universe one to universe three to universe 555 to universe 1280, and beyond that, in new universes that's being made by a cosmo being right now. You are a God star and a goddess because you get better at everything that you do. Man, we can talk about this stuff all day, baby. That should be light. That should be light. <laughs> Man, when that when that when that when that, when that advanced intelligence kick in with a cosmo being, we are the Google websites. You know what I'm saying? So, okay. If I teach somebody how to perform a particular martial arts that I brought into existence within myself. If I brought a new martial art into existence within myself and someone asked me to teach it to them and I helped them evolve with it as they helped me evolve as we are both being a master and a disciple to each other, that shows that we are God stars and goddesses of the angel number multiverses getting better at what we do. Come on, baby. If someone can make a game system, get better at making game systems, you know what I'm saying? Memory cards. That's the definition of a god star and a goddess, right? Mm-hmm. Yes, indeed. You know, man, every other divine alien race from all these angel number multiverses will tell you the same thing, son. They'll tell you the same thing, sis. The Arcturians, the Namekians, you know, any alien race whether they are all male alien race or all female alien race you know <laughs> come on bro the sorelians they'll tell you the same stuff you know this stuff is lit man mega man x will say the same thing naruto will say the same thing <laughs> neji would shino would come on son yusuke from yu yu Hakusho would do the same thing come on son Ipo Makinochi, Miyata Ichiro, Sando, Takamura from Hajime no Ipo series. All these anime character protagonists and the comic book protagonists and nonfiction protagonists, god stars and goddesses will tell you the same thing that I'm telling you, bro. I'm telling you, sis.
Come on, son. We are the God stars and goddesses. Don't, don't let anybody tell you that you ain't a God star or a goddess because the definition of a God, a goddess, always ascend on up, transform on up. That's why I made a video long ago talking about soulful low vibration, which is a suppressed low vibration state that a cosmo God star and goddess have, a powerful high vibration, and then a powerful evolutionary self vibration. It is lit. Let's get right, man. Come on now. We talk to them. Come on now. I'll go, man. I'll go to anybody's house and say the same stuff right now. I'll go to the woods and the forest and speak to animals, sharing this, even talking to the anthropomorphic animals, like you see off of Beerus the cat, off of Dragon Ball Super, Gene the fish. <laughs> Come on, son. I'll tell every single divine alien species this type of otherworldly soulful information. You know what I'm saying? And this type of soulful otherworldly information, only true God stars and true goddesses would love this stuff, man. Especially the, the especially the copper skin, carbonated alien goddesses who look like me. If they was to come across this video right now. Whether they was a next door neighbor or just long distance from a whole nother universe in the multiverse, they will love someone like me. That man, them, 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 them copper skin carbonated guys, they'd be like, "Damn, he intelligent, man. I gotta get, I gotta get me some of Jules Unimas, you know, Harsh Souls. I'm telling you, he trademarked this definition of what a god star and a goddess is. Mm hmm. We lit out here, boy. We lit out here, sis. I know my man. I know my man, Yami Yugi Prab. Yami Yugi Prab, Yugi Moto Prab. Mm hmm. The all seeing mind, heart, and soul eye, baby. Mm hmm. If you can level up with your key energy, right? Your chakra, your Nin energy out there, for those who have seen Hunter x Hunter. You know what I'm saying? Your chakra, your key, your Nin. You get better tapping in to unleash more divine powerful key powerful chakra powerful nin energy within your otherworldly chosen one emotional and intelligent divine featuretarian advanced powers within you that shows you that you are a god star and a goddess that always level up man it's going from beat to beat it's just like rhythm of a of an instrumental baby you know what I'm saying? My boy Siegfried from Kenichi will understand what I'm talking about when I bring music reference into the cause yo, if you get better at anything you do, it's just, it's just like it's just like a it's just like a goddess, right? A goddess that, you know, does a lot of you know, healing jewelry. You know, does a lot of twerking near candles and stuff like that. Getting better at that. What does that show you? That shows you that she's a goddess, right? That shows you that, um, you know, goddesses and god stars is around. You know, I could see a frog. Could be a powerful god star. Could be a powerful goddess. See what I'm saying? I'm telling y'all. I'm telling y'all. These are all facts, man. All mud. All mud. All mud. All motherfucking facts. <laughs> man. I could talk on days for this. You know what I'm saying? Like, seriously though, these are the type of conversations I like to have with soulful beings, especially soulful goddesses that are really authentically intelligent. They love conversations like this because it stimulates the mind, heart, and soul. You feel me? Man, <laughs> this video that I made right here, I could have had a whole conversation sharing this with a with a lovely, a lovely copper skin, carbonated brown skin goddess. Talking about how we are god stars and goddesses of the cosmos when we get better at what we do. Oh yeah, speaking of it, you know, sex. Okay. The more you have sex, the better you get at it, right? The better that you get at healing your cosmo divine god star or goddess in the bedroom or the back seat or anywhere the more you do that you get better 
That's what the definition of a god star and a goddess is, right? Yes, indeed. I just put you on game. Now, I'm going I'm to go ahead and just like shout out the whole angel number multiverse for this divine movement of what a definition of a god star and a goddess is, man. This is some futuristic information right here. Mm-hmm. You heard it from your boy, Jules, Unimines, you know Hearts, you know Souls, a.k.a. Cold Shield 21. We etsing out the indoctrination, baby. It's out the indoctrination. Be in tune with the all-seeing mind, heart, and soul eye. The all-seeing mind, heart, and soul eye, baby. Think with all three. That intuition thinking, intuition feeling, emotional, and intelligent advancement.